Yo guys, it's Chris here, back in another video, and this is technically my first video I'm making of Forza Horizon 4 with me actually playing the full game. Um, so yeah, uh, basically, I prevented watching any videos on how like the progression works in this game and such. Uh, so, uh, like, because I, I wanted to come in with open mind, I didn't really want to know what happens and such, so I just finished the winner showcase, uh, so I'm now halfway through his story I believe uh, this is the first time actually in Edinburgh uh, or Edinburgh whatever you want to call it because I've been doing all the events around here so far I've got a million three hundred thousand and I've got um, let's see how many cars do I have uh, I can't see because my uh, overlay is in the way but there's a two there so it's 20 something uh, this is the fourth edition car I got the uh, Alfa Romeo. I don't think I have any other Forza editions. Uh, I like the uh, commons and stuff like that uh, and legendaries. I got the Gera, obviously, the Zonda, and yeah, so that's what I have for that so far. Uh, but today, we are going to be building my dream car. Now, my dream car is not exactly a multi million dollar car. In fact, it's the exact opposite, and I'm sure any of you who have watched any recent, or not even recent, any videos on my channel know what car I'm going to be picking, and if you know me from uh, real life or Instagram, you do, uh, you know exactly what car I'll be picking. So, there is a body kit for this car, which is nice. Uh, I never actually saw which one is in the game, so that'd be cool to see. Uh, let's go over to it right now. Uh, where is it going to be? I'm in. I kind of like this new like design. It is different, but it's okay. Uh, so we are going to go right here, the 1994. So they don't have the 92 or the 96. The 94 is the 1.8 liter version of the Miata which is nice. Uh, it's better than the 1.6, which is 91 through 93. Uh, these are some cool paints and such, but I'm going to make my own paint here. I do want Mariner Blue as my dream, like, as my car, uh, but there is this cool design. I just want to see what it looks like on the car. It's not this one. It's, it's a dark. I would say it's more like that. I'll just go with the Mariner Blue for now. So it's only 25,000. It's always one of the cheaper cars, but they did add a body kit, which uh, I don't know. I mean, it looks okay. It's nothing special or anything, uh, but yeah, I'm just going to be building this as to what I would want it to be as a dream car, and I'm hoping to get this car uh, sometime in the future. So it's going to look here. We got the pop-ups, obviously. Oh, it won't let us look at the engine. That's not cool. Otherwise, it's a uh, fairly... A simple car. This antenna is huge. What the heck? Why is it so big? <laughs> okay, never mind with that. Uh, we do have the Forza Vista so we can upgrade our cars while we're uh, in our house, I believe that is. But I'm actually at the festival right now, so we're doing it like that. Um, so let's go ahead. And I am still just waiting, actually, before I start this. I want this so bad. Like, you know, if we play City Camo, you know how good it'd be? It's just incredible. Da -na -na. It's beautiful. So many amazing... Uh, <laughs> I don't even know. I don't have words for it. It's just it's going to be so fun. So we're going to start off with um, so, custom it's upgrades. It's a garage, obviously. It's where you come to work on your cars. As you can tell, this is the first time Makes I've actually so upgraded. Let's see what engines so we can put in here. you want to totally change the insides of your car. Oh my. Here's where you can do what? that. Oh, we could put the TJ in here. Uh, 2 liter nine four V8 Turbo Rally or 2 liter, but we're just going to keep the stock 1.8 liter engine. Uh, drive train, obviously got to keep a real world drive, it's a Miata. I, in my uh, dream Miata, I will have it turboed, not supercharged. This is the body kit, it's okay. Uh, I mean, it's not like incredible or anything. Doesn't make the Miata look the, be uh, the best or the worst. Uh, so I'll just add my own little parts to it eventually. Want to change your car's aerodynamics? And we always here. like the garage uh, very here. I usually like I like the front bumper. 
on this. I think the garage very looks better though. And I want a duck wing. Or anything. I mean the duck wing is okay. I don't think it adds a whole lot to this car. But it looks better than the stock, so we'll go ahead and put that. The bumper, I gotta get the garage very bumper on here. The bumper delete. Oh, I could go for. Yeah, I do like the racing uh, beat better. And side skirts. Um, let's see. I'll just keep stock on there. And hood. Go for that, I guess. I mean, that actually looks. You could tell, like, this looks pretty decent. Uh, tires. Most importantly. Now. You can change out your the tires, tires and wheels here. There. And very 215, I'm up 215, 30, 235s or 245s, yeah, 245 works. Uh, rims, I have to, what are the rims that are always on here? I can't, I never remember the name. Like, I know it's something with an R on it. It's gotta be around here somewhere, is this it? No, it's not. They're like, they're black and they're, uh, I don't know how many they have, like six or seven, I think. I just gotta find the name of them. Are this a, or are this a, yeah, great grammar. Uh, these are close, I don't think those are it though. There we go. There they are. All right, so we got those, put 15s on it. Yep. And front width here. Um, let's just get it tucked good. So I'd say the second option here. That just looks too weird. I don't like that actually. It definitely needs to be uh, lowered. Definitely. All right, drive Here's where train. You with your drive train this so is you where can we will all make everything good. Down. <clears throat> uh, let's go drive line here and differential. Basically everything. Um, here we go. Here's platform handling. handling. I gotta get my brakes in tuning, here. That kind of thing. And here we will go to lower them. Ooh. Oh my! The drift lowers it so much. All right, put race on there. That looks good. Just up these so we can tune it. My Miata would be a track Miata, if anything. No roll cage. And you gotta get that weight reduction. Alright, engine, engine upgrade, realistically, if you're under I would want to do an intake, an exhaust, have the turbo upgraded, intercooler, and that's it. So. You keep shopping, have fun. We got all this I'll stuff. The price for you 50k here. worth. Just let me know when you're done. 24 items. We go so from 2,300 pounds to 1,900 pounds. And 128 horsepower to 234 horsepower. And we're up to A class 766. So let's just see how crazy this car actually is. It's always been known as the low horsepower car, in which it is. Um, but it's always had one of the best power to weight ratios. And so having less than 2,000 pounds and over or around like 230 horsepower, this is going to be really good. I mean, all right, let's, let's see this. Got the pop-ups and everything. There's the interior view here. It's very Miata-ish. Got the uh, iconic air conditioners. Right. Let's go to a spot where there are no radios. Alright, radio off. Let's get out of the festival area. Alright, how does she drift? Let's see this. Oh man, I cut the inside too much. Uh, overall, it looks really good. It's got the hard top on it, unfortunately. I would have my like, soft top. Let's do a sound test.
Yeah, pretty good sound test there. Uh, yeah, I'm liking this. I... No, not my mirror. I mean, this thing... If this is what my Miata looks like, then I'm sold. <laughs> I mean, this is incredible for a Miata. And it's so light and nimble too, it's just like... Ooh. Is it this... Okay, it is a 6 speed. Let's just take it here. I'm terrible at drifting, by the way. Flip it a little J turn. That's yeah, not even a J turn. Um, so yeah, this is technically the first video of the set. Hit a like if you enjoyed this. Subscribe if you want some more Forza Horizon 4. I don't know how the uh, audio is right now. This is kind of a test video. So, yeah. See you guys next time.